Back. Great to have you here on WKYT. Public schools in Lexington are hiring right now. Keon Massey with Fayette County Public Schools is here to tell us about all those open positions. Thanks for coming in. I guess summer's the time to uh, kind of take care of some of these things, right? It is, yes. yes so, it is. so we're talking about positions where for people who don't want to teach, they want to do other things. What are these openings? Right now we have a lot of openings for custodians, for food service workers, grounds workers, um, even substitutes. Uh, we also have openings for our police officers. We have our own police department with Fayette County Public Schools So and grounds workers. So just lots of different things that don't require a teaching certificate if you're interested in working for the yeah, schools. Yeah, a lot of things that people might not think about. Right. Yes. Yeah, it takes a lot of staff, yeah. certainly. Uh, what qualifications are required? I, I would think that would be position by position, right? It is, but for the most part, on uh, this side, if you're not teaching, you just need to have a high school diploma or a GED. Mm -hmm. And uh, for our paraeducator positions, you should have 48 college credit hours. But if you don't, there is a state test that we actually uh, give. We administer that test, and you can take that, and we'll get you in. Uh, and process. A background check required? Absolutely, yes. Uh, we initially asked for one through the administrative office of the courts. That's part of the application process. And then once you're hired, you have to be able to pass a fingerprint through the FBI and the state. So are these part-time or full-time positions? They are full-time positions, mm -hmm. yes. What about benefits then? We do. We offer benefits. We offer health, dental, vision, uh, life insurance, and then also short-term disability and long-term disability as well. Okay. Keon, what would you say the best thing is about uh, working for the school system? Honestly, the best thing is the kids. Uh, even if you are not in a classroom, you still have an opportunity to make a difference in the life of a student. Like our custodians and even our grounds workers have an opportunity to interact with our kids every day and just the conversations that you have and the joy that they bring. Um, and then our benefits are really good too. When you work for us, typically you don't have to work over winter break and we all get spring break off. And so everybody might likes that. That, that occasional <laughs> snow first. day might come yes, along. Yes, yes, yes. Well, and I just think you get a certain energy when you're working around kids. I, I really oh, think that's a, a great place to be. Now you did mention substitute teaching. Are the qualifications different for that? They are, yes. And if you want to be a substitute teacher, you just have to have 64 college credit hours. And uh, there is an emergency sub certificate that we work with the standards board to get you issued, but it's a very simple process. So. FCPS.net, correct? Right, for uh, information about uh, the jobs, folks yes. can click on there, see what's available, see if they might uh, be interested. And uh, lots of positions open right now. You can call 859 381 4740 for the Fayette County Public Schools. And now, Keon, we're talking about these jobs. People might think, oh, well, you know, school doesn't start for a while, but the time yeah. to apply is right now. Right now. Yes, absolutely. Please, because August will be here before we know it. It certainly will. We want to get people in and ready to go. Yeah, get their interviews and, and get to <laughs> process for a paycheck, right? That's right. That's <laughs> right. right. Yes. Well, yeah. we appreciate Thank you, you coming. Much. Thank you for having me. All right.